is at the utility company. The crows start building their nests around the end of April, and they scavenge for garbage discarded by people and often can be seen nesting on electric power lines and causing power failures. In Hokkaido alone, 52 power failures were blamed on crow's nests last year. In Kushido City, 2,300 households, including hospitals, were left without electricity for an hour. It makes us feel sorry to remove the nests the crows have worked so hard to build. So the company decided to install special devices to prevent crows from building their nests. This device makes it impossible for the crows to land on the power lines. We check to see how well this new equipment works. <laughs> we are dealing with the crows, which are very clever birds. We'll have to invent something better. We need to adopt a long-term strategy. The next plan is to install this cone-shaped metal device. It will be installed at several locations where crows are likely to build their nests. But yet again, the plan was a failure. The crows began nesting in the narrow space just under the device. Our attempts were not very effective. It seems that the crows are outmaneuvering us. In this contest of wills between humans and crows, it appears that, for now, the crows have the upper hand. <laughs>